So we took a trip to the Emerald Isle to spend some time on the Red Planet as yet another shaven-headed Mason. Darius Mason this time, grandson of Alec, baldy hero of 2009's Red Faction Gorilla. At the Dublin event, Red Faction publisher THQ had generously laid on a selection of actual firearms for us to look at but not touch between bouts of Red Faction Armageddon. While they were looking the other way though, we were all over them shiny guns. We had Jim Boone, the game's producer, help us compare and contrast the exotic super weapons of Red Faction Armageddon with the people perforating guns of boring real life. <laughs> So uh, first of all, tell us about Signature Weapon, tell us about the Magnet Gun. So the Magnet Gun is definitely our signature weapon. It's, it's a gun where it's very simple to use, where you fire a main projectile out, you can fire at any destructible object or any, any enemy in the game, and then you fire a second projectile out, and whatever the, the first projectile is attached to will come colliding with the second one. So you can do a lot of creative things like taking giant chunks of concrete off a building and slamming it into an enemy, or taking two enemies and slamming them into each other. Um, creating all kinds of, uh, of mayhem, so it's a, it's a very creative weapon to use and we've seen people use it in a lot of fun ways. Uh, whereas in the real world we have a Beretta 9mm and it fires bullets. And then next up we've got the Nano Forge, right? Yes, yeah, so the Nano Forge has a, a few different uh, abilities, so the main one that people tend to use is called Impact, and what that is is it's a medium range burst of nanites that does, it does a, a major amount of destruction right in front of the player. So if they want to do something, if they have something that they quickly want to blast through, maybe there's a wall that's separating them from their goal, you can just tap the button and it immediately just destroys through the wall and you can run right through it and go onto your objective. Uh, slightly bigger and more exotic, we've got the M4A1 and it also uh, fires bullets, is that right? No, it fires uh, little pellets. Okay, and then your third favorite weapon? For mine, it, it would be the uh, the the, play, the phase plasma beam. Um, the plasma beam will actually, it's you can think of it as almost a giant lightsaber. It's my favorite way of describing it, where it's this huge burst of energy that will slice through anything that, that's destructible. So you can have a gigantic building and just slice it from the base of the building, and then the whole building will come crumbling down. And then all the way at the other end of the spectrum, we have the M60 here, which, uh, tell us about the M60. It fires bullets, I guess. Uh, same as the other one there. It's uh, plastic babies, except this one is 900 per minute. So don't get in the way of it. All right. Yeah. 